Hi children, some more measurements we are looking at in pictorial form. Thicker, thinner, all measurements we are trying to understand through pictures. Here we are doing two measurements, thicker, thinner. What is thicker, thinner we are going to look at in picture form. Shall we? Yes. When you look at pictures, you understand better. What are we learning? What are the two measurements? Thicker, thinner. Let's look at our first picture. Thick and thin. Now, this is a thick pencil. This is a thin pencil. When we compare the two, we will say this pencil is thinner than this pencil. Or you will say this pencil is thicker than this pencil. Little children love to use thick pencils or thick crayons. Yes? Thicker, this is thicker pencil, this is a thinner pencil. When you look at the picture, you understand what is thicker and thinner? Good. Let's look at another picture. Look what we have here. We have a thin book here and we have a thick book here. What is the meaning of thick book? A book with many pages, a book with less few pages. Which book would you like? Would you like the thin brown book or the thick green book? When you compare the two books, we say the brown book is thinner than this green book. Or we say this green book is thicker than the brown book. So this is thicker, thinner. Thinner, thicker. With the picture, you understand the two measurements, thick, thicker, thinner. Good. Let's go to another picture. See what we have. We have two candles here. Look at the candles. Thin candle, thick candle. Look again. The thin, thick candle gives thick flame, big flame, huge. And the thin candle gives a very small thin flame. This candle is thin. This candle is thick. We say this candle is thicker than this candle. Or this candle is thinner than this candle. Thinner, thicker. Thinner, thicker. Good. Now you understand what is thinner and what is thicker? Let's go to another picture. The picture is helping you to understand thick and thin. Yes, these are, this is a part of a huge tree, a log, piece of a log, a tree trunk. And here you have a small branch, branch of the same tree. Look. This log is thick and huge. This is thin. This is thicker than this. This log is thicker than this log. This log is thinner than this log. Now you understand the two measurements? Thinner, thicker. Yes? Good. Let's get on with another picture. Look at the picture. We have... Two matchsticks here. This matchstick is very thin and this matchstick is thick. So we say this matchstick is thicker than this matchstick or this matchstick is thinner than this matchstick. Thinner, thicker. Thicker, thinner. Yes, you understood now what is thicker and thinner? Let's go to Another picture. Look at this next picture. Look, you have a paintbrush. You have a thin paintbrush and you have a thick paintbrush. Yes? Now, this brush is thinner than this brush. Or this brush is thicker than this brush. I hope now you are learning what is thicker and thinner. The two measurements. 
I am sure you have understood. Let us get on to another picture. Look what you have here. You have two lines painted. There is a thin line of paint and there is a thick line of paint. You can use the thick brush to paint a thick line, thin brush to paint a thin line. This line is thinner than this line or we say this line is thicker than this line. Thicker, thinner. Thicker, thinner. Good. Let us look at another picture. Look, we have two tires here. You have noticed daddy's car has got a very thick tire. And if you look at a cycle, it has got a very thin tire. Thin tire. This is thinner, thicker. Thicker tires are for cars, lorries. They are very thick tires. Yes, cycle tire or small motorbikes have a thin tire. This tire is thicker than this tire. Or this tire is thinner than this tire. Thicker, thinner. Have you understood what is thicker, thinner? Good. Let us look at another picture. See what we have here. We have two animals here, a squirrel and a mouse. Look at their tail. The mouse has a thin long tail and here the squirrel has a thick tail. When we compare the two tails we say the squirrel has a thicker tail than the mouse or we say the mouse has a thinner tail than the squirrel. Thicker tail, thinner tail. Now you understood what is thinner and thicker? Good. Let us take another picture. See what we have here. I am sure you have seen mommy cutting slices, bread slices. You buy a fresh bread from the bakery and cut it. Take the knife and cut it. And here you have three thin slices and here rest is one big thick slice. So this is a thicker slice and this is a thinner slice. Thicker, thinner. Which one would you like? Would you like the thicker slice to put jam and eat? Or would you like a thinner slice? Thinner, thicker. These are all thin slices. Thinner, thinner, thinner. All these are thinner slices and this is a thicker. This slice is thicker than this slice. This slice of bread is thinner than this slice of bread. Thicker, thinner. Did you learn the measurement? Thicker and thinner, did you understand? Good.